back to the Amy White channel, where today, Fam of the Opera is going to delay its closing. Now, as you guys may remember from my last video, Fam of the Opera said they were going to close like a month before Beetlejuice. Beetlejuice would close the next month. But since people have been going to the show so much, they have decided to delay the Broadway closing after the sales spiked. Last week was the highest grossing in the show's 35th, 35 year history. As you guys know, Fam of the Opera is in the Majestic Theater and Broadway, but it was originally set to close in February. But the, the plan is to extend the run by eight weeks. We've sold out virtually everything that we have on sale, the show's producer Cameron McTonish said. Um, Alright. The Family of the Opera is going to continue haunting Broadway while longer. Um, so yeah, it was going to close in February. But immediately after the closing was announced, ticket sales were like, like that. So, instead of it closing in February, it's going to close in April. Um... That's good for me, honestly, because I wanted to go see Phantom. And I'm not saying I'm going to go see it the month of, like, my birthday. But, like, it would be a nice early birthday gift. Then again, there's, like, the Mickey Dolan's thing in April as well. So it's like to go to Phantom of the Opera to go see Mickey Dolan's. It's our decision. And why not run forever? See, why won't Phantom run forever? So, like, let's say, until the closing announcement, the show is not selling enough tickets to defray its rising running costs. The slow return of audiences to Broadway following the pandemic and inflation were both contributing factors. That's why, um, you know. Oh my god, some dude's wearing the mask. I'm gonna wear the mask when I go to see a show. Uh, so will- But that leads to the question. Will Fam of the Opera, like, not close? I feel like it shouldn't close. I feel bad for people that are just discovering it now. Yeah, me too, honestly, me too. Oh, Mac Macintosh said there will be no further extensions. Following the show's closing, um, the Schubert organization is planning a renovation of the Majestic Theater. Ah, oh, where the Phantom has since well, run since opening. The show will mark the end of its Broadway run with an April 14th benefit performance to raise money for charities and the final performance of an audience, including alumni and friends of the show. I hope Paul Stanley goes. I know he's on tour right now. Phantom had a lengthy North American touring life, and they've also toured in Canada, but. Hey, I said that Paul Stanley video was coming. Didn't I know? It's not like the show is going anywhere. The show will be done, and it's being done. Uh, it's being done all over the world. I'm sure it will come back to America, and we'll do a tour in the future. Macintosh said, "And will it return to Broadway? I'm sure at some point it will." He said, "It's a great show, and the great classics do come back." Mmm. I don't think Phantom should close at all, but hey, it's my opinion, my opinion. But I'm glad it is extending its closing. Most musicals don't get that chance, like, uh, Prom and Be More Chill nearly closed the same day, and that was a big fucky wucky because those are both, like, gay musicals in a way, you know, there's a lot of stuff, well, there's a difference, because, um, the Prom had lesbians, and Be More Chill technically had one bisexual man, Rich Goransky, but, you know, still, uh, while it is sad to see Phantom going, at least it's being extended, and we'll still be able to see it, I wish the same could be said for Beetlejuice, but we don't have any news about that yet at all, so, yeah.